Hey guys, I'm Aaron and welcome to Aaron Plays Fun Facts. In each episode, we invite our friends to ask Aaron some fun facts they really want to know. Let's take a look at today's Ask Aaron video. Salut Aaron, j'avais une question pour toi. Je voulais savoir si tu connais des animaux qui se transforment dépendant de leur habitat où ils vivent et aussi euh, si maintenant qu'il arrive un incident ou qu'il perd une patte ou quoi que ce soit, ça repousse. Ça marche? Alors j'ai hâte d'avoir ta réponse et au plaisir. Merci Jonathan. Moi j'aime aussi des animaux. The natural world is a tough place. Faced with competition for resources and sometimes hustle climates. Life can be difficult for animals, but in order to beat the odds and survive, some animals adapted in some pretty interesting and unusual ways. Voici 10 animaux qui se sont adaptés de façon folle pour survivre dans leur habitat. Here are 10 animals that have adapted in some bizarre ways in order to survive in their habitats. Let's go! Number one, wood frogs freeze their bodies. To survive the winter, out of 60% of Alaskan wood frogs, bodies freeze solid. They also stop breathing and their heart stops beating. This allows them to survive temperatures as low as minus 80 degrees Fahrenheit. And in spring, they thaw out and come back to life. To achieve this semi-frozen state, the creatures build up high concentration of glucose, up to 10 times the normal amount, in their organs and tissues. The sugar salutes act cryoprotectans, preventing their cells from sinking or dying. Fact number two, kangaroo rats survive without ever drinking water. They have adapted to survive in the desert without ever taking a sip of water. Instead, they get all the moisture they need from the seeds they eat. These critters have incredible hearing and can jump up to 9 feet, which helps them avoid predators. Fact number 3. Antarctic fish have antifreeze, proteins in their blood. Five families of Natathanioid fish can make their own antifreeze protein to survive in the frigid southern ocean encircling Antarctica. The proteins bind into ice crystals in blood, preventing the fish from freezing. This adaptation that is so extraordinary, that explains why these fish made up 90% of the fish biomass of the region. Fact number four, African bullfrogs create mucus homes to survive the dry season. The African bullfrog lives in the savanna of Africa when it gets very hot and dry. When a frog is out of water, mucus on its skin helps it breathe by dissolving oxygen from the air. So in order to prevent its skin from drying in the hot African climate, the African bullfrog buries its health six to eight inches underground. And then it creates a mucus membrane, which hardens into a cocoon. The frog can stay in this cocoon up to seven years while they wait for the rain. Wow, can you imagine sitting in one place for seven years? When the rain arrives, the moisture from the rain softens the cocoon into back the mucus, softens the mucus and wakes the frog, and signals the start of a rainy season, the time when the frog breeds when it is most active. Fact number five, tube worms turn toxic water into food. Scientists long thought that life couldn't exist at hydrothermal vents deep in the ocean. But in 1977, they found giant tube worms living along Galapagos. What was that? Galapagos? Galapagos? Galapagos Rift, 8,000 feet below the ocean surface. These tube worms are surrounded by total darkness in their habitat and live in water filled with toxic gas and acid. These creatures have no stomach, gut, or eyes. Instead, there are bags of bacteria with heart-like structures and reproductive organs. The bacteria inside the worms use the toxic hydrogen sulfide in the water, which would kill most other animals, as an energy source to produce carbohydrates. Fact number six, okapi has scent glands on their feet. Okapi are strange animals that look like a combination of a giraffe and a zebra. They live in the Democratic Republic of Congo, which is very hot with many predators like leopards are always lurking. To stay alive, Okapi has 
three key adaptations. First, they have scent glands on their feet to mark their territory. Second, they have infrasonic call, which allows them to communicate to their calves without predators hearing their call. Third of all, they have 14 to 18 inch long tongues, which can be used to wash your eyes and ears. Fact number seven, we all know that one of the most common animal adaptation is camouflage. Many animals have physical adaptations that serve as a disguise. They can hide out in the open because they blend into their environment. Because polar bears fur is white, for example, and they blend in with the snow. But do you know some animals sound, look, and behave like other animals too? The red spotted purple butterfly is a mimic of the poisonous pipe vine swallowtail butterfly. A bird can't tell them apart, so it will not eat other one. When an animal imitates another animal or an object to avoid predators, it's called mimicry. Fact number eight, the common king snake is immune to rattlesnake venom. What better way is there to silence your competition than by eating them? The common king snake is so specialized to that end, but not only do they hunt by clamping down on a snake's jaw before constricting it to death, they have also developed an immunity the rattlesnake venom, making the vipers one of their favorite food sources. Fact number nine, the thorny devil drinks with its skin. In the Australian outback, pole water can be extremely hard to come by. To deal with this issue, the thorny devil has developed skin that can absorb water like blood on paper. From the way the scales on the body is structured, it collects drew and channels it down to the corners of the mouth, and the lizard drinks it. You can actually watch the lizard's skin darken as it soaks up whatever liquid remain even from the monkeyest puddles. Fact number 10, the Irrawaddy dolphins are a fishing guide. The Irrawaddy dolphin is a species of dolphin that live primarily along the coastlines of Southeast Asia. Closely related to ochre whales, Irrawaddy dolphins have adopted not through some physical trait, but rather through a unique behavior. Over the years, they have developed something of a partnership with local fishermen. They will drive schools of fish towards the fishermen's nets. In exchange, they have the pick of the helpless fish before the nets are held in. This is an incredible example of nature adapting to human influence. And there is no other animal in the wild that interacts this closely with their human counterpart. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Leave a thumbs up if you did, subscribe if you haven't already, ring the notification bell, leave in the comments down below what's your favorite adaptation of animals, share this video with friends and family. Alright, that's all for today. See you guys in the next episode. Peace.